Hey, I'm Kins, and welcome to this week's episode of Found Footage. It's three random horror games, but under a stupid title that I've given it. This is Goodbye Gordon. Looks like a interesting indie horror game. It's free on Itch.io. I think it's a Half-Life based horror game, which sounds interesting to me as a big fan of Half-Life. I would like to do a super nom, super big shout out to our Patreon supporter, a rub 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 you super nom kin. Love you so much. Thank you for the all support on Patreon. And a shout out, a super shout out to our Patreon producer Alice as well. Thank you so much, Alice. If you want to be a nomkin like a rub 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 and Alice, link is below for our Patreon. Get early access to videos and more. And please remember, uh, if you can't support on Patreon, we understand. Consider liking the video and commenting. It really helps us with the algorithm. And I'll try my best to respond to every comment on all the videos. So um, anyway, let's get into the game. Without further ado, let's go. Oh my god, this is half life. Another day, another d d dollar, am I right? Excuse now, me. Now, Gordon, we'd be be better get a move on. on. Okay. Oh my god, that's so fucking amazing. This is just like half life. Oh my god, the opening. The only thing that's a bit different is the weird fucking walk cycle. Hey, Fever, guys. It's a living nightmare. Oh. <laughs> Play okay, brilliant. This is this is going well already. What the fuck? Find six play coins. Is this like slender? Oh god, this better not be like it is slender. But with a scientist. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that made me jump. Are you fucking kidding me? I heard you. I heard you. Need my my coins, Mr. Freeman. Shut up. I actually can't sprint, which is a problem. So, this is so fucking weird. This is slender in Half Life, picking up weird fucking play coins. <laughs> this is so stupid! What the fuck? <laughs> it's, this is just a meme, and that's fine. Oh my fucking god. I don't know how I'm going to avoid him if he comes in here, by the way. This is the locker room down here, from what I recall. It's gonna be one in the locker room, right? Locker cooler is at you. You must run immediately. Yeah, I thought so. He, he teleports around, but seemingly not seemingly unfairly, at least at the moment. We could have easily missed some coins somewhere though, so let's uh, keep going. This should be a dead end though, I think, unfortunately. No, it's not. This is where G-Man is in the headcrab attack state place, right? Yeah. Oh, there's one in that room. Dr. Cooler will destroy you. Ah, hello, Gordon. How about you shut the fuck up? Okay, he's getting much faster. My power grows, Gordon. Does he have a gun? I am so fucked. I am so fucked. He's being really persistent. He's getting closer. Oh my god, this is actually freaking me out. Please be the sick play coin around here. Grows, He's got a gun. He's got a fucking gun. Are you fucking kidding me? Ah! Ah, hello, Gordon. No way can this be down here. I just think I just fucked myself. I think I just fucked my... I did. I just fucked myself. Gordon? Shut the fuck up. Alright, so I'm missing one play coin. At least I know where he is at all times at the moment. Gordon, none of this is real, is it? <laughs> I like his voice clips, they're very good. 
Very good. This is good shit. This is dumb, but good my shit. Power grows, Gordon. Is he saying my power grows? I think he is. Which is not good, really. Feed my, my coins, Mr. Freeman. This isn't in the original. There it is. I did it! Beat the video game! <laughs> What the fuck? What a stupid game! <laughs> let's see what happens if he gets this, shall we? Let's 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 let him. I'll let him get us once. For the meme, I will let him get us once. Another day, another dollar. Am I right? I like this shit a lot. Like this is this is silly. I already decided this is gonna get a norm on the thermometer just for the nostalgia meme this. I fucking love Half-Life. One of my favorite games ever. It's so fucking good. Anyway, let's continue, shall we, into the realm of more. Doctor Pooner required play coins. Where is he? I wanna go and hug him. I wanna hug him. Come here, Numkin. Science is Numkin. Ah! Jesus Christ, that got me. Are you fucking kidding me? That really got me. Gordon. There he is. None of this is real. Ah, hello, Gordon. <laughs> Goodbye, Gordon. <laughs> he was my best friend. <laughs> Alright, next game. Holy shit, that was great. So this game is called Smudged, and it has Scream as a spacebar, which is uh, interesting. Let's try this out. Hold forward to move, press space to scream, hold shift to sprint. Collect all letters in this game. Th another Slender game? Oh. Oh no. Why is there a box covering half the screen? I don't have to get rid of this box, guys, but we'll we'll wing it for now. Oh, we leave like a trail behind us. That's kind of cool. So we're in a maze with very restrictive movement and like these weird lanterns. Okay, I thought I could get rid of it with T. I can't. That's all of you telling me. The fuck is making that noise? I don't like that noise. Oh, hi there. Can I scream you away? Oh, screaming paralyzes them, okay. Uh, what the fuck was that? Oh my god, these creatures are horrific! It's kind of cool though, I like that. It's a shame about the weird box that won't go away, but other than that... Looks like they're all following me now, which is... Shit. I wonder what word we're gonna spell out here. We're gonna get totally jump scared a bunch here, you know that if they hit us. They get us, we're fucked. Yeah, it's like it, the game doesn't like the resolution that I'm running at, or something like that. Alright, anyway. I wonder what the word is. Well. <laughs> It's still there! Bullshit! Bullshit! It's still there. Nah, okay, so... I'm not... I really like the art style. Not too sold on the on the gameplay. But I do really like the art style. I will give it that. So far. Very creepy monsters. I like the sort of, like, Japanese sort of layout. But that's because I'm a massive weeb and you all know that by now, you know what I mean? So it's no surprise why I like that. But I like the mechanic of screaming as well. It reminds me of that really old um, Ichio game where you flipped off the ghosts. You want to remember that one? Like it's when the enemies scare you, you flip them off. It was funny. At least for someone as immature as me, it was funny. But the rest of the time, you know. All right. 
God damn it! All right, I want to have one more try, but uh, so far smudged. I'm feeling mixed about it. Yeah, there's no get rid of the thing on screen thing, which is annoying. Don't know what that is. All right, anyway, here's the plan. We have one more try. We get jump scared a few more times, and then we move on to another game. Because this, while beautifully realized art-wise, and I salute whoever made this art, really good shit. Um, Gameplay-wise, is not is not good. Like I have no problem with the old school uh, movement either. You know what I mean? I'm just screaming to try and get them off my back a bit. All right. I wish I knew what the word was. I'm not very good at, at, at that sort of thing. Y you guys know what I mean. Existing. Uh, and as a result, I fuck things up on that front quite a bit. God, I, 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 the, the whole point of this is to make it hard to navigate, and I get that. I used to play like the old sort of like, you know, like Lands of Lore, shit like that, the dungeon crawlers that had this mechanic. It was pretty cool. What is that? Why is it smudged? I don't get it. That's the first time we've seen something that's this. Was that that was that was a smudge? Do I pick up the smudge and the mosquito was on the other side of it? Is that what just happened? I think that was what just happened, by the way. Unfortunately, I'm just going around the big circle, and I think I just fucked myself. Unfortunately. All right. That smudge is something that we need. Let's try and head back towards the smudge. Why did the music stop? Okay, it looped. What is this? What the fu- Ah! Oh. Okay, so it's like a teleporter. That's kind of cool. Alright, so we're missing one letter. Pretty sure it's an H. There it is. What? what hang on, what? Wait, what? What? I don't even know what it's spelled. Fe fe uh, God damn it, I'm an idiot. Chat, what, what? Twitch, not Twitch. I'm not streaming this. YouTube, what the fuck was that? I don't understand. Anyway, that was smudged. I'm not going to play it on hard mode because I didn't like it very much. But visually, lots of fun. I'm going to give this a bum on the normometer. It's not awful. Just a bit, eh, you know. Anyway, next game. <laughs> All right, guys, this is called Don't Do It. It's a free indie horror game. Currently number one trending on Itchio at the time of recording. Probably won't be when this video goes out, but still. Let's check it out. I got hired as a new scientist three months ago and was placed in the genetic engineering team. Hmm. We have restricted access to certain areas in the building. Some have said we'd lose more than our jobs if we are too curious. But how can I not be when I sometimes hear strange noises? Once when I worked late at night, I saw a crowd of people being led downstairs, but I never saw them again. I brought it up to my lab manager, and he said not to worry about it. I don't think it was a good idea to tell him. Okay. I wonder what the research lab is brewing. Well, I'm guessing it's probably not Jem. Where am I? What? There's something in my pocket. Oh. Day 309, block number 3. This is Dr. Nguyen, director of JN Squared Bioweaponry Research Lab. We made history today. Specimen number 21 survived. It is a beauty, a deadly one. We will continue to monitor its behavior in the observatory. I am so fucking dead. I am so fucking dead.
I picked up Dr. I can't actually pronounce that. Dr. Nugent is how I pronounce it, but that's not how you pronounce it. Because it opened a barred door of the observatory, half of my staff didn't make it out alive. Great. Fucking wonderful. Absolutely fucking wonderful. Okay. It's really dark, this, by the way. Okay. Oh, do you see that? That doesn't look good. On the security camera, there's like a, a floating blob. Use number pad. We've got some lovely, completely healthy fetuses floating in these things. Pretty sure that's what fetuses look like. I'm not an expert, obviously, but if I had to make a guess, I'd say that's what a fetus looks like. There it is. For our large orders. It is time to move to plan B. If I press the button, I'm pretty sure it's going to open that and let that thing out. Which I'm not sure is a good idea. Like if, I'm perfectly, if I had to make a list of things that I consider the good idea, it wouldn't be that. Oh. Day 410, lock number one. Today is the debut of our greatest discovery to other members of our secret organization. Everyone is excited. The world favors chaos over peace. My name will be written down in history as the creator of version one. Oh my god, it's like SCP, it's redacted. Alright, so I don't think there's anything else to do except right, fuck it. Oh my god, I'm so fucked. Hi. I think it's right behind me. It's too dark to tell, if I'm honest with you. Hi, everyone. I'm actually freaking out quite a bit right now. Oh. I think I was meant to go through that door that I didn't see there and, and just watch it. Observe it. But instead I let it out. Oopsie doopsie. Well. How's it going? This guy's breathing. Oh, I know he's not. He's, he's just like wafting in the wind like a fart. Anyway. I guess... I guess, I guess we'll try not to get killed by it. There it is. It's a big boy. I'm going to go back in here for a second because I don't think it can fit. Hello? There it is. <laughs> you can just see his lights. I can't see shit except it's fucking lights, by the way. Like, that's it. That's all I can see. It's probably going to kill me, but that's fine. I don't know the key card number. That's the problem. Like, I don't know what it is. I don't see any place where that is either. I got a key. I guess the key was to the observatory. I guess it must be in the observatory, right? That must be where the key is. God damn it. And now I can't get back in here. I fucked myself. I absolutely fucked myself. So what you get for like pressing things you shouldn't press is that 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 was it I think it's really hard to tell. Goodbye. It's so dark. There's no flashlight either. There's got to be a code. Maybe it's written on the wall in Jam. Let's see. Has any of you guys got the code?
I don't know where it's gone. Used number. For I don't. Ah! <laughs> I don't have a number pad. Oh, I don't. I don't know. I don't know what to make of this. All right, this time we're going to go through the observatory correctly. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? You asshole! You asshole! Oh, okay. I'm not doing this again. I, I, I'm still going to give this an air. <laughs> just, the game just trolled this shit out of me. I have no idea where I'm going to find the key card, but um, the passcode for the door. But it's an interesting premise. And the jump scare is good. I just wish it wasn't quite as fucking dark. It's really hard on YouTube. It's going to be like people are going to be like, "What the fuck is happening?" But anyway. Thank you very much for watching, Nomkins. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, slap a like on it. We're going to try and do these weekly where we jump into just three random games that are too short for one video and hopefully have a a fun time looking at some of the random shit <laughs> that uh, excretes from the bowels of Ichio. Some of it's great. Some of it's all right. Some of it's good. Some of it's terrible. Hey, you know, we're just, just going to be hit and miss. I'm going to not know anything about these going in when I do these. So anyway, thank you for watching this episode of Found Footage. I will see you in the next installment. And leave a like and a comment. Let me know what you think of the video. And uh, would you press the red button? That's the most important question of all. Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoy the videos, consider pledging to our Patreon if you can. Link below for that too. Gives you access to videos early, as well as lots of other cool stuff, private playthroughs, non content, all exclusive over there. Go have a look. Thanks for watching. See you later.